I'm Luke Massey and welcome to the Cayman Islands, known for their beautiful beaches, incredible weather and stunning diving. But did you know you can bird in this paradise too? Up to 246 different species of bird have been found across the three islands here. So join me as I explore Grand Cayman, Cayman Brac and Little Cayman to see what I can find. So today we're on the Mastic Trail, which winds its way through the Mastic Reserve, and I'm accompanied by Stuart Mailer, an expert bird guide and naturalist here in the Cayman Islands. So Stuart, could you tell me a bit more about the Mastic Reserve? Yes, the, the Mastic Reserve is an area of dry limestone forest that remains pretty much in the condition it would have been when Christopher Columbus sailed into the Caribbean. And there are not too many places left like that. It makes it very special. And as far as birds are concerned, well, you can find all 13 of our endemic species or subspecies of birds that are found on Grand Cayman. Uh, if you look just to the left of that bromeliad up there, he's just hopping around now. We're actually watching a Cuban bullfinch, but obviously we're in the Cayman Islands. So what's a Cuban bullfinch doing here? But Stuart, you were saying that there's a bit of news on the Cuban bullfinch. Yes, there was a paper published a year or so ago making the case for the bullfinch to be reclassified as a full species based on morphological characteristics and also on the cause, as I understand it. And, and speaking of cause, you might have just heard that rather distinctive descending series of notes. Da -da 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 -da, followed by da -da -da -da. To my ear, it sounds a bit like he's counting. And it's one, two, three, four, five not una dos stress, so I think that clearly makes him a Cayman bullfinch, not a Cuban one. <laughs> oh, Vitaline warbler on the rock just to the right there. Ah, one of the endemics. Really taking an interest in that leaf. Oh, it must be something delicious in there. Yeah, it's a, a beautiful little yellow warbler. They couldn't call it a yellow warbler because that name's already taken. The Vitaline is from the Latin vitalis for egg yolk. We have almost the entire world population of the Vitaline Warbler in the Cayman Islands, so if you're a bird and you want to see one, this is the place to come. Jam-packed with the Cayman Islands endemic subspecies, the Mastic Trail is a must for any birder. Today we're at the Queen Elizabeth Botanic Park on Grand Cayman, and we're sat on this palm tree next to a great little pond. In front of us we've got two migrant species, blue-winged teal and a stunning great yellow legs, but that great yellow legs is getting a bit of hassle from the local black neck stilts and we've just got a little green heron and a tricolored heron all on this little pond a major tourist attraction great bird and they don't care about us and we can just sit here and enjoy them as they go about their business and just before we leave the pond you've got this stunning white crown night heron another migrant to add really big red eye and i mean they're night herons so they fish at night he'll hang out in here during the day and then as the sun sets he'll come out and switch roles with the little green heron and the tricolour heron I guess and a yellow warbler flitting about as well not bad this birding in Grand Cayman is it Queen Elizabeth Botanic Park here is brimming with birds. You can hear all around with their stuff calling. There's the sagas flycatchers fighting each other, alanias, vitally warblers, banana quits sucking from the flowers, but also one of the Cayman Islands' prettiest and colourful birds, a male spindalis. He's got these amazing white eye stripes, kind of fiery breasts, and he's hopping about, preening, cleaning his beak, really showing off for us nicely. It's getting quite hot here, so I've sought shelter in the shade. And whilst doing so, I've come across a pair of Cayman parrots who are also doing the same thing. We have seen a few around the park feeding on fruit and flowers, but these guys are having a good old preen. They're actually one of two national bird species in the Cayman Islands. The other one is a very closely related cousin, the Brack Parrot. Now, telling the two apart can be tricky, but one of the main things is that the Brack parrot has a white forehead, whereas the Cayman parrot has a pinky blush on the forehead. 
From the parrots calling off in the shade to Caribbean Alanias having a welcome shower in the water sprinklers here. The Botanic Park and Mastic Trail are just two of Grand Cayman's top birding sites. Easily accessible and full of birds. What an amazing few days on Grand Cayman, seeing what nature it had to offer. Next stop for us is the sister islands, Little Cayman and Cayman Brack, to see what we can find there, because on the Cayman Islands, it's full of surprises.